you'll notice that our page title on the left has now also changed to introduction and this can be a useful way of finding our pages within a pack when we have a long list of pages to look through. So how do we add an image to our title page? Well this is done through the optional properties at the top on the right. You'll notice a drop box arrow at the end of the box. If I click on this we get a whole series of different options that we can add to our page. And the fourth option from the top is a background image. So I click on this. Unfortunately it isn't automatically added as a property. So what I need to do now is to add it to the page. When I add it to the page it also puts a button on the left hand side which would allow me to delete this. So if I make a mistake and add the wrong property I can easily delete them again. On the right hand side is an import media button and I click on this and get the option to import an image just as I would when I'm importing images from elsewhere. So I'm going to put the image of this dog onto my front title page as a background image. So I click on open, it adds it to the list and we need now to see what it looks like with this image added. So we publish our project or learning pack in order to save it and then play or preview our learning pack. So here's our new title page to our learning pack. Unfortunately the background image is hiding the text. So we need to make it more transparent so that the text will stand out against it. So let's close this preview and go back to our editing screen to add this alteration.